Someone sent a picture to my wife and said, hey, look at this guy, he's hot. And, I, and, I, and she showed me, right? And I was like, who's this doofus? You know what I mean? I just, I was like, you know, I didn't know. I had no idea who he was. I didn't know his name or anything. And that's the first time I remember ever seeing him. I think after that, it was in Gold's Gym. We just started training together, you know, started one workout at a time and stuff. And uh, we got along outside the gym as well. You know, we had the same sense of humor, love to play video games. And, uh, you know, he, uh, He's just a good guy, all around good person. In this world of bodybuilding, you know, a lot of people were out just for themselves and stuff, and I always kept to myself, and then I met Cal, and I was like, wow, got a guy that got some of the best genetics in the world. You know, every, everything in the world going for him. He has every right to have an ego, and he still does it, you know what I mean? And uh, you don't see that, you don't see that in many people these days. Yep. Papa. Oh shit, still the fucking master. <laughs> still, he's my father in lifting weights. Still shows me how to do it. <laughs> it feels like the old school bodybuilding, like the guys used to train together, eat together, party together, you know, go to the beach or do whatever together. And like, well, it's not that way anymore. It's like, I've been backstage at shows and nobody even talks to you. I'm like, you know, I know we're in competition with each other, but it's still, you know, we're having fun and stuff. And, I like having the camaraderie. Come on. Hey, come on. Come on. Okay, let's go. I just licked your sweat off this machine. <laughs> I just licked your sweat off the machine. Just tongue the fucking machine accidentally. Like, yeah. yeah, I always like training with um, older or bigger people, stronger than myself. Some people that have got more experience, knowledge, because I can learn from them. I feel like the line in the in the in the pride with the the half of the mane and he's the the line with the big mane i'm just like trying to catch up to him yeah i'm saying you're the mature one <laughs> and then everyone else saw the crossfitters here like the hyenas uh, yeah. scratching around trying to take our fucking uh, weights and shit our scraps <laughs> yeah just leave the scraps for them and we just <laughs> just stay focused uh, yeah. yeah because the line doesn't give a fuck about the hyenas because they're like kind of uh, they're disadvantaged. Uh, they were born with uh, their back legs were actually shorter than the front legs, so they're already disadvantaged. The guy has supreme genetics, so he's a lion. I'm not trying to be mean, but it's real. Genetics are a big part of bodybuilding. If it wasn't genetics, everyone could look like me. Everyone could look like Frank. It's all you, man. Ah, both of them. Ah, yeah. You shot the pressure. <laughs> 